Hey guys, uh, as you know, as anybody who's a big horror fan knows, today was a sad day in horror movie history because we lost another legend. We lost Wes Craven not too long ago, and today we lost Gunnar Hansen, who played Leatherface in the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This, uh, this is, uh, it's really sad because Texas Chainsaw Massacre, always one of my favorite films. And, you know, Gunnar Hansen is one of the reasons why that film is so good. It's just that performance that he gives in that is, it's iconic, it's legendary. And uh, there have been a lot of people who, you know, played that character since then, but they never got the, I mean, if you, if you watch his portrayal, in the original, there's something about that performance is really, really special. It's no one's been able to do that other than him. Um, I know that when he was doing research for the character that he spent a lot of time with uh, mentally challenged people, kind of learning their mannerisms, how they responded to things, stuff like that. And he brought that into the character of Leatherface and uh, I never, unfortunately, I never got to meet the man, but I, I do know people who have met him, and I've watched plenty of documentaries, I've watched interviews, commentaries with him talking about, you know, Texas Chainsaw Massacre and other things that he's done, but primarily Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and uh, every time I've seen him, he always very intelligent, very down-to-earth, very gentle I guess gentle appearing like he, he he seems like a very gentle kind person very very intelligent not like just not like you know crazy and psychotic like Leatherface um, but very very good uh, if you if you do get a chance definitely try to check out a commentary track with him on it because he he has a lot of funny stories that he tells about you know what it was like making that that movie and uh, it's it's interesting to get things from his perspective how I know one of the things that always made me laugh was that he had no idea that it was going to be called Texas Chainsaw Massacre he thought it was going to be called Leatherface and he was going to go down in history you know that, as that his character is the name of the movie but 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 uh, it didn't turn out that way. But he still went down in history as uh, one of the great, great characters in horror. So uh, it's it's sad. But so uh, you know, rest in peace, Gunner. We really enjoyed the impact that you made on horror movies and the legacy that you leave behind. So. Uh, I'll see you guys again. Bye.